For radiant objects, the brightness we sense depends on two factors, the rate of energy emission and the distance we are from the object. Brightness, we say, is inversely proportional to the square of the distance between the observer and the source. So r is the distance between the source of light and the observer. Let's try and illustrate that with an example. On the left here we have a candle and it's emitting light in every direction. And you can imagine the light traveling outward from the candle in a sphere that continually gets bigger and bigger as a given light wave gets further away from the candle. So this candle you can imagine is pulsing with spheres that are continually expanding. There's the next sphere, there's the next sphere, one sphere following after the next. The area for a sphere is 4 pi r squared. So if we take a little bit of this energy from the candle, of course it's emitting light in every direction, but let's just take the little bit that is emitted right here at a distance of one meter, that little bit of energy is now dispersed over this area. Well, if we continue following that energy to a distance of two meters away, what we find is that that same amount of energy is now spread over a much larger area, an area that is two squared or four times larger. If we continue following that bit of light to a distance of three meters, we can see that that light is spread over a yet larger area, three times three. So we can see that the brightness or the intensity of light is inversely proportional to the square of the distance from the source. So the light here would be bright, right there would only be one-fourth as bright over there only about one-ninth is bright.